What's going on everybody? Kulipas Tech here, coming back at you with another video. In this video, I'm going to be giving you 5 reasons why you should buy the Samsung Galaxy A04s. Now as always, if you do end up wanting to learn more about this phone, definitely check out the description, where we'll be linking to several other videos about it, as well as some information about pricing, availability, and some of my favorite smartphone accessories. But with that being said, let's get right into it. So my first reason why you should buy the Samsung Galaxy A04s is the battery. Now with this phone, we're getting a 5000 mAh battery that supports 15 watt fast charging, so definitely a great battery here. With a 5000 mAh battery, in the US at least, this is pretty much the largest battery you can get in a smartphone. So of course, with this device, you can expect to get some really good battery life. So if you're in a situation where maybe you're not always around a charger, but you still need to use your phone all day, in that kind of situation, a phone like the A04s with such a large battery is definitely going to be a great choice. And in addition to having a lot of battery life per charge, down the road as the battery degrades, which all batteries do. With a larger battery like this, it's not going to affect you nearly as quickly as it would with a smaller battery. So if you like to get one phone and keep the same phone for a longer period of time, then this phone is going to be great for that as well. And honestly, when compared to other phones in this price range, sure there are plenty of other entry level phones that have 5000 mAh batteries too. In fact, for that matter, every Samsung Galaxy A series phone, at least for the recent past, has also had a 5000 mAh battery. So that's really nothing new. But I have seen plenty of phones around this sub $200 price range that have really small batteries for whatever reason. So again, in general, if you are looking for a phone that has a really good battery, but you still want something on the lower end, more affordable side, then in that case, the Samsung Galaxy A04s is going to be a great choice. My second reason why you should buy the Samsung Galaxy A04s is the storage. Now with this phone, we're getting 64 gigabytes of internal storage with micro SD card expansion. So for a phone in this price range, this is definitely a great amount of storage. Sure, on one hand, if you're more of a power user, if you're constantly downloading all kinds of apps, games, stuff like that that takes up more space, then even 64 gigabytes might not be enough for you. But in that case, you're probably going to be going with something that has a better processor and everything anyway. So in general, for the average user, as long as you're at least a little mindful of what you're putting on your phone, and you make sure to use a micro SD card whenever you can, the 64 gigabytes we're getting with this phone is going to be perfectly fine. Now, a little caveat I want to mention here. As of the recording of this video, in February of 2023, the AZO4S is not officially launched in the US yet. And while I do think it will be pretty soon, there is a chance that when it does reach US carriers, the storage specs might be a little different. So of course, it is possible. I mean, I hope it doesn't happen but it still is possible that we end up seeing a US version of this phone that only has 32 gigabytes. And that would really be too bad because at this point in 2023, 64 is honestly really a bare minimum for anything. But again, just keep in mind, this phone in my hand is the unlocked international version. So if things end up changing by the time you're watching this video, just know it is possible. My third reason why you should buy the Samsung Galaxy A04s is the photo quality we're getting with the camera. Now with this phone, up front for the selfie camera, we got a typical water drop notch. This camera is five megapixels. Then on the back, we got a triple camera setup with a 50 megapixel main camera, a 2 megapixel macro camera, and a 2 megapixel depth sensing camera. So in general, despite unfortunately not having an ultra wide camera, which is a complaint for a completely different video, I do think the camera setup we're getting here with the AZ04S is definitely good. Sure, the features are pretty standard, but the most notable thing here is the 50 megapixel camera in such a low end phone. And not only are we getting some real decent hardware here, but the actual photo quality is really good. To give you an idea of what it can do, here's some photos taken with the main camera. And yeah, I would definitely say these are really good photos photos, especially considering they're coming out of such an affordable phone. So if you're taking a lot of pictures, maybe for social media, for example, because keep in mind, portrait mode does work really well in here too, then I do think the Samsung Galaxy A04s is going to be a great choice. My fourth reason why you should buy the Samsung Galaxy A04s is the software. Now with this phone, we are getting Android 13 straight out of the box. And while pretty much every Samsung Galaxy A series phone at this point does have Android 13 too, compared to other phones in this price range that aren't Samsung's, like for example, the Motorola Moto G Play 2023, which I will be covering on this channel real soon. I know that phone specifically does only have Android 12. And as far as I know, so do pretty much all the carrier branded phones too. So my point here is, if you really do want the latest version of Android in this price range, the Samsung Galaxy A04s for us is really going to be one of your best options, if not the only option so far. And with this phone, not only are we getting Android 13, but considering Samsung software support, you can also expect several major updates in the future. So again, if having the latest software is important to you, but you're still looking for a more affordable, simple device, then in that case, the Samsung Galaxy A04s is going to be a great choice for you. And finally, my fifth reason why you should buy the Samsung Galaxy A04s is the large display. Now with this phone, we're getting a 6.5 inch 90Hz PLS LCD display with a 720p resolution, a PPI of 270, and a 20x9 aspect ratio. So on one hand, the image quality I will say isn't really the greatest, especially if you're going to be consuming a lot of content. 
if you're just watching videos all day and stuff like that, you're probably gonna want a 1080p resolution. But at six and a half inches, this phone is definitely on the larger side, which tends to be a good thing when you're doing stuff like reading, web browsing, maybe some social media and stuff like that. And while having a six and a half inch display is honestly a standard at this point, I still do think it's definitely large enough to give you a good experience. In addition to this, we're also getting a pretty nice tall narrow form factor here with again, a 20 and a half by nine aspect ratio. So if you're doing something in landscape mode, like watching videos, for example, you're gonna get a nicer, more immersive experience things are going to look a bit more cinematic. And when you're doing your web browsing, social media, stuff like that, with a more tall, narrow form factor like this, you can fit more content on the screen without having to scroll as much. So in general, despite not being the best display ever, for a more low-end device, I do think the size and dimensions really make up for this. And if you are going to be on your phone a decent amount, the size and shape are definitely good enough to give you a decent experience. And honestly, when it comes to the image quality, while of course it's definitely not ideal for a dedicated content consumption type of device, despite only having a 720p resolution and showing a few pixels here and there because of it, I do think things look at at least decent, the colors do look nice, and compared to a lot of phones like this, it is a bit brighter and has slightly better viewing angles. So honestly, for an entry level phone, if you are looking for a pretty nice display for the money, unless you get something like the Samsung Galaxy A13 LTE, which honestly that phone has its own problems, you're probably not going to do a whole lot better anyway. And with a 90Hz refresh rate, the movement on the screen is going to be a bit faster and smoother, and while this isn't really going to do a whole lot, you probably can't even notice it in this video, it will make the phone feel a bit more premium to use. So in general with this phone, the display is definitely good enough to give you a pretty pleasant experience overall. But those were my 5 reasons why you should buy the Samsung Galaxy A04s. In general, if you're looking for a more affordable phone for more basic activities like web browsing, social media, stuff like that, and you want a really good camera that takes super nice photos, the latest version of Android, great software support, and a really large battery, then in that case, the Samsung Galaxy A04s is definitely worth considering. Now once again, if you want to learn more about this phone, definitely check out the video description where I will be linking to several other videos about it, as well as some information about pricing, availability, and some of my favorite smartphone accessories. But that's it for this video. If you enjoyed it and found it useful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to follow Kalipas Tech on Twitter and Instagram. And as always, I will see you in the next video.